Greetings everyone and welcome to another video here on my YouTube channel. Today it's something a little bit different if you're a regular viewer. I've just been shopping on the bike because uh, as you might have heard in the recent news today, traffic levels are, the, are at the lowest since the 1950s so there's never been a better time to get on a bike and do a bit of shopping. So here we go, it's a run of the mill hybrid. Okay, I paid a little bit more but it's not as expensive as something perhaps say like an e-bike which a lot of people uh, fork out money for these days. So uh, yeah, I'm going to show you what's inside, what I'm carrying today, what I've just bought. So uh, uh, let's get in the kitchen and open these bags up. So let's see what I went shopping for today. Let's have a look. Lots of essentials really. So I bought some bread. There was absolutely loads of bread in the shop I went at. Tons and tons of bread. Uh, butter. Also bought some apple juice. Some milk, some almond milk to top up what I've already got, which is not much money to pay for everything. And I've got on oh, this particular bike, I've got uh, well, this this bag setup we've got here. It's a this bike we call Toe Peak, and on the on the rack, it's I think it's a called a quick rack, quick release or quick rack, I think it's called, and it's the MT uh, MTB large bag in there range. So uh, it's got panniers on the side. Huge space for that, that uh, what, what? This bag in the middle, that just came out of there, so there's plenty of room. Tomatoes, bananas, which I'm going to take out the bag right now. I don't like leaving uh, bananas in the bag too long. I know they've been in the shop all day, but uh, I don't like to leave them in plastic bags. I bought two boxes of cereal. Now, uh, quite small, but these were £1.15 was the uh, adult branded cereals for like three pounds or something and I was like I'm not paying three pounds for a box of cereal so I just got to, to uh, chocolate squares nice and healthy for biking yeah uh, as are whispers <laughs> that was a bit of a treat so that's one side of the uh, the bikes bag so we'll have a look at this side as well so uh, yeah um, as you can see even up to now I've got a reasonable amount of shopping in and uh, wasn't too, too too hard today. It's been nice, lovely weather, so the sun's been shining. Uh, and you know, if you're going to go out into the rain, you dress accordingly. There's no excuse for getting up, you know, going out on your bike and doing a bit of shopping. Really, get a few bits of what that you need. Also bought some Warbton's crumpets. A bit of a late night snack. All important bike lock, bike pump, uh, inner tube, tire levers, just in case you get a uh, puncture. Some ambrosia light Devon custard. It's my best West Country accent there. And it's actually the Easter weekend coming up, so uh, as no one's buying Easter eggs for each other, I, I don't feel selfish at all buying myself an Easter egg. So I've gone for Cadbury's Dairy Milk. Just gone for one of these. I can't guarantee I don't buy another between uh, now and uh, Easter Sunday or Bank Holiday Monday. So that's one, first one. A couple of empty carry bags to put all the food in when I moved from the supermarket to the bike. Some uh, peach slices. Some dolmio bolognese. So I can make some pasta. Uh, you know, I don't think I've got any minced beef though, so uh, I'll have to see what I've got. Actually, I think I have. Might be okay. Coffee. I'm running low on coffee. I'm drinking a lot of that recently. And I don't know about you, but in my coffee I like to have a teaspoon of sugar, so I bought some sugar, that's getting low as well. And I think we're nearly done. Uh, I bought some digestives, another treat there, some uh, milk chocolate slices. So as you can see, lots of shopping here, um, an awful lot actually. And it was quite easy to get here actually, I had the wind behind me today, so that helped. So what I do, below the video I'll put some links um, to the bike rack that I use, you can see hiding in the bag there, uh, and this uh, Topi bag as well, so you can uh, perhaps go have a look at it yourself. As for the bike itself, it's uh, just a regular bike really, it's from a company called Roo, and it's the Foray uh, 17, nothing that remarkable about it really. So there you have it folks, and like I said at the beginning of the video, now has never been a safer uh, time to get your bike out of the garage and just get cycling, even if it's not for shopping, just to perhaps uh, 
go go out with the family for a few miles in your local area and it's up to you whether you're gonna wear a helmet or not it's, uh, it's not mandatory so to tell up to you as you see I just don't matter what you wear either I just went out riding this comfortable gear because that's it for me I'm gonna put these uh, in the cupboards I uh, hope you enjoyed this video if you want to uh, subscribe you know where the button is and hit the notification icon as well if you want to receive notifications on your phone so you enjoyed this video and uh, hope to see you out on the roads see you later bye bye